Personally, I think that the Vivo performances are some of the best performances out there for any musician to be a part of because Vivo does such an incredible job at all aspects of the creative process in the sense of the set design and where the artists are performing, the aesthetics, the coloring, the, the color grading of the videos, the mixing of the music, and then of course they bring in some of the best talent in the world. And it's really exciting to see SB19 performing at the Vivo on the Vivo essentially live sessions because the, as an artist, as, as an artist myself, watching other artists on these Vivo sessions, it's like, I feel like a, a, a like I'm not, I wouldn't, pinnacle is not the right word, but like a really cool, like, um, stepping stone or like it, it's an exciting part of an artist career when they get the opportunity to perform in these Vivo sessions because it, so many art, other popular artists have done it. So it's like an honor. I guess the word is honor. So how cool is it for SB19 to be performing their song, uh, a couple of the songs here in the, uh, the, the, the this live performance at uh, Vivo. So I'm really looking forward to checking this out. If you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Jacob Restituto. I'm a musician from Northport, New York. If you're coming back, thank you so much for coming back. I appreciate you. If you haven't subscribed, consider doing so. And let me know what you think of this video in the comments below. Let's see what we got. Oh, and look at that. I did not know that Vivo, uh, Studios was in Brooklyn, New York. Ah, uh, as a New Yorker, I really had no idea. I don't. I just kind of just assumed it'd be California. I, I also could see Vivo having multiple offices, but I don't know why I thought that they. Oh, it's also Vivo Studio NYC. I've never. I don't think I've seen that before. I wonder if they have multiple locations. Attraction, it's a passion, baby. I'll get for you. Don't you ever doubt it? How about it, baby? If you're gone now, babe, honey, did it tell you come around me? All right, let's pause this. We're 30 seconds in, but we gotta talk. One. It's kind of cool. You don't very often see pop groups or, or, or musical artist groups with several singers that trade off line by line. And I know that there are they have plenty of songs that um one or one of the singers will just sing one uh whole verse or and then somebody else might harmonize and they kind of alternate like that but here we're starting it off with essentially one line each and it's kind of cool uh just to see because they all have a unique timbre of voice their own unique way of pronouncing things the un way of um, the syllabuses and cadences they all kind of have a unique sound every, as every other artist does and it's kind of cool to keep it the listener really engaged um and additionally to that it's really cool to see uh how well vivo knows the songs in the sense that it's well choreographed with between the artist and this the videographer because you know, we start with Josh, then we go to Stell, then we go to Pablo, and, and the camera knows that, as opposed to, like, what would happen if we were going, like, you know, the camera went this way, but and the singers went this way, but what happens if, if, if the camera went that way and the singers went that, you know, like, it wouldn't work, but, like, it's really well choreographed between the, 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 um, the videographer and the artist. It ain't I want you, and ain't nobody else Harmonies are tight. Layers in the backing track. Nice. Yes. Vinyl slow down in there. Right. Listen to that. Ready? Fresh. It's like what we call a vinyl slow down. Essentially, in vinyl days, when you would like slow down or stop a, a recording, it would like the, the, because it's spinning the record when it stops it gives this kind of ooh, slow down kind of sound um we can replicate that now without vinyl today in, in modern uh, production uh but it's a, it's a nice touch in, in music uh for a live performance this is so incredibly clean like the like the vocals and the performance and every aspect of it it, it sounds like if i was I had my eyes closed and didn't know this was live i would have thought this was a studio recording it is so well produced Oh, 
pulsing synth in the background. Slide. What I really like about the mixing of this is that all of their voices are mixed in di different timbres in the sense of like, or different EQs is a better word, uh, where like some some of their voices have a brighter tone and some of them have a warmer tone. And, and, and because of that, uh, obviously that's no natural timbre of their voice, but also just in the aspect of how they're mixed, it creates a really nice full layered spectrum when they sing harmonies as opposed to all of them being bright, then you're kind of clashing within the same frequencies. It, this is, it, it does such a good job at thinking out and, and, and planning out their performances and recordings. It's, I don't know, I think that they just do a really, really, really good job. Tight choreography. Choreography. What I really enjoyed about their performance here is, is how performative it, it, I guess performance based or performative, I don't know what the right word is, it was in the sense that like, it didn't. It, they, it felt like they were in the performance, like almost like an acting performance, more so than like a singing concert. Like there's something about when an artist gets, gets so immersed in their performance that you actually feel like you're watching like a theatrical performance as opposed to like a like a live music performance. And there's something that really draws a viewer in when it turns to this creative theatrical aspect of it. Um, like you could feel that they were like lost in the in the moment, and not caring what people were thinking or doing or acting. And it's just like yeah, they're in that performance i don't know it's just a different level of, of a performance i think that that's really really cool so i hope you enjoyed that let me know what your thoughts were in the comments below thank you so much for watching I'll see you in the next video have a great day god bless and peace out